Hey family, Prophetess Tara Carissa here in Grand Rapids for the Girl Get Your Fight Back Conference with Pastors Beverly and Jathan Austin. I'm so excited to be here and I believe that the name of that conference, Get Your Fight Back, is a word for you on today. If you are to go into your promised land, you are going to have to get your fight back. I'm reminded of the children of Israel as they were fleeing from Pharaoh. Uh, they were on the run, but sometimes running is a part of your fight because it means that you're still alive. It means that you're still moving. It means that where you are, you made up in your mind that is not going to be your final resting place. No, you are going to press through to your next place no matter who is pursuing you. You've got to get your fight back. I'm reminded of Joshua when he was now supposed to take the children into their promised land, there were giants in the land. But watch this. They could not lay down and die and give up because there were giants in the land. No, they had to say to themselves, we can take these giants. And I want to tell you something right now. If you are to possess the thing that God says is yours, that marriage, that family, that business, those finances, that ministry, whatever it is that you are believing God for, it will be birthed out of your fight. You're not going to get something if you give up because it's getting tough. It's getting hard. People are talking about you. People are lying on you. People are laughing at you. Let me tell you something about people. Uh, they still have to submit to God as well. So what that means in the final analysis is that you better do what God told you to do and you let God handle the people. God has never had a problem handling your enemies or his enemies. So you're going to have to take your focus off the people and put your focus on your fight. Don't die now, baby. You survived too much. You've been through too much. God wants to take you into too much for you to give up now. I don't care what you've been through. If you are alive, that is an indication that there is something more that God wants to show you and walk you into. I want you to be encouraged because you've got to get your fight back if you are to possess your promise. I love you, but it's time to fight. Be blessed.